Welcome to Hudson River Park in ever beautiful I Love New York. And welcome to 90 Days of Fitness. Spring training starts today. And it may look like a rather cold day in New York, but around this time of year is 90 days uh, from my desired destination date. And we'll get into that in just a second. But first, I wanna welcome you to Healthy on the Hudson. And really happy to be seeing this on day one of 90 Day Fitness. It points out all the different points here in Hudson River Park where you can get some activity and wellness. Now, why 90 days? Why today? Well, it's February 20th. I and mean, around this time of year is 90 days from the opening of the beaches in this region of the United States, which is Memorial Day weekend, which also happens to be my birthday weekend. So a lot of reasons point towards that as uh, being my goal date. And how do I achieve my 90 day fitness? Well, often I find five mile runs in Hudson River Park uh, to be my choice of method for working out for that 90 days. But I change it up every year. One year I did absolutely no additional physical activity and just ate alkaline foods like celery, cucumbers, and radish, and coconut water for 90 days. Another year, I did yoga every Wednesday and cardio during the week, and they all had great results. And every year, our bodies change, so we should mix up our physical fitness routine as well. Hey, look, someone built a snow person here in... Hudson River Park. That's one of the things I do love about this time of year is you get to see the changes. So although I may walk the same exact route a couple of times or run the same exact route, I'll see spring. I'll see the first leaf of grass. I'll see the first iris. I'll see the first forsythia. And it's really quite enjoyable. But this year, I was not feeling motivated to run five miles. So I decided that I'm going to walk over to see the snow in Central Park. And I'm wearing my watch for the first time, which tracks how far I've walked. And it said that I've already did my four miles. So I'm not gonna turn around. I have it set to just turn off once I reach uh, my five mile marker. And I think it's gonna be a great change uh, to doing things a little bit different this year. First, I wanna look in these windows and see what is in this structure. But I think it's gonna change uh, what I'll be doing this year because Hudson River Park, for me personally, I knew exactly where to turn around because I had used uh, maps to see where two and a half miles was from my home. So I knew exactly when to turn around and go back. And that turned out to provide a great surprise because in Hudson River Park, you don't have to stop. There's no traffic lights. And I found, you know, I was able to shut my mind down and get into what felt like for me, mobile meditation which was great but now now that i have my uh distance tracker here on i may walk around just to see different neighborhoods and uh, then turn around once i get to two and a half miles so i think it'll be uh something slightly different for this year but wellness can be free you don't have to join a fitness program just get up and start moving and that's part of the reason why i wanted to share this today and i also do love welcome signs as you know Welcome to Hudson River Park, which is open until 1 a.m. So if I'm working a night shift, I could still get out after work and do either a five mile run or like today, a walk in Hudson River Park. And here's a look of uh, the beautiful view of New Jersey. That is the Hudson River with a New Jersey view. Till next time, hopefully you're inspired to do some wellness for yourself. You are worth it. Till next time from ever beautiful Hudson River Park in I Love New York.